Yeah, I think um, so. So basically, if you look at the dialogue, like um, Oro no, Orochimaru, <laughs> um, Momoshiki basically says like um, he being Kawaki, um, he um, he manifested his omnipotence through Ada, right? So basically, like again, she's just a utensil, a tool, um, in, in, in a metaphorical sense. She's mm -hmm. the wishing hammer, but the hammer in and of itself can't do anything on its own at this scale. It requires both of them together. So yeah, I, I do think um, she wants to uh, make Kawaki happy. She desires um, what he desires, right? So yeah. um, both of these two desires are basically in lockstep. So yeah, I do think she is definitely one of the the critical pieces, but also so is Kawaki. Yeah. Uh, I'm playing around with the idea maybe Borto could um, take Kawaki's place. Um, I, I, I do think it's possible for Boruto to wield the hammer as well, in this case, the hammer being Ada, mm -hmm. um, just in reverse to put things back. Um, I don't think Kawaki is necessary. Um, but the, the problem with that is, will Ada want to fulfill Boruto's desire? Ada. <laughs> so, yeah, she does. Yeah. The, uh, Momoshiki does say that identity... I Wait, hold on. I need glasses. The identity of her charm is simply the result of Ada's subconscious desire made by made material by omnipotence. Her subconscious desires, Boruto says, is Kawaki's desire be to become reality. His desire, right, uh, right. his desires becoming reality. It was he said there is no way for Amano to know, having only the scene, only seen the reality, concluding that it was Shinjutsu, is understandable. Uh, and oh. this current phenomenon is Kawaki's desire becoming reality. Yeah, so um, basically, uh, Amato calling Ada's enchant ability uh, divine arts was a mistake. It's yeah, not yeah, divine yeah. art. Yeah, but he he made the assumption, which is mm -hmm. which is interesting um, about Amato because obviously, um, a, a lot of what he's saying isn't like definitive, right? It, it's just like based upon his limited perspective. Um, so like you can kind of look back all the things he's been describing up until this point with like a grain of salt and say okay well maybe is this isn't the truth it's just his version of the truth based upon what he understood at the time but yeah yeah so that kind of throws out the theory that amino is she buys you know um vessel because i think she would have been aware of that and end result amino would have been aware of it as well bro bro I mean, or i've be been telling you guys that amada is a gentleman bro. like <laughs> yeah, fact, fact, fact. I don't. Right. I don't think but it I'll... necessarily fully throws out the idea because, like, he can be the vessel absent of like the consciousness of the Otsutsuki that's inside of him. Um, but mm. I, I think um, maybe like if, if there's some mind manipulation shenanigans, because they are talking about like manipulating minds and stuff. Um, Otsutsuki can do that if they desire. I think that's mm -hmm. a little bit of an ominous bit of text. Like, um, oh, yeah, like, have you ever con thought about um, if humanity's minds have been wiped? I'm like, okay, what do you mean by that? Okay, right, that's interesting. Right. So, he did say yeah, that. So could, he said that. Yeah, so could Amato be... That in the past. Oh, sorry. Sorry, go ahead. Oh, no, 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 no. You're fine. It's a conversation. <laughs> no, but like, um, could Amato be like the actual vessel, but just had his, had his, have his uh, mind wiped or something of the sort? And then also, like you were alluding to, um, there's like um, kind of playing around with the idea like, Hey, how many Otsusuki have been here? And then we look at the mm. Otsusuki in the Ten Tails dimension. Oops, they all seem to be on Earth, but we don't know about the ones that are scratched out. So maybe they were here. We knew about them, but we just don't remember. Something like that. So it's interesting. Yeah, yeah mm -hmm. definitely. Because he said that um, there were other Otsusuki guys. So like Shibai wasn't the only one. And um, they could have manipulated human memory, you know, from ages ago. And you just don't know. So that that was actually really interesting, too. I've been, like, dabbling in some crazy, like, conspiracy theory things. But it's not really conspiracy theories because it's actually true. But, like, about the Emerald Tablets and stuff like that. And about ancient people who, uh, ancient aliens, I guess, if you want to call it, that came to Earth and, like, mm -hmm. manipulated DNA and stuff like that. And that's where we got human. Blah, 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 blah. But anyways, like, I was just thinking, um, you know, Amado could be something of that sort. Mm -hmm. Since he knows so much about the karma seal, that would mean that he um, either, you know, um, had real close 
you know, um, contact with an Osuski that gave him this knowledge, or he's an Osuski himself that actually manifested this knowledge and is tinkering with it, you know, because he tinkered with Kawaki's karma cell. And he also gave, uh, I'm sorry, not Kawaki. Yeah, Kawaki's karma cell. So um, that's what I was thinking. I, I was like, maybe he is an Osuski. Maybe he's not Shibai. Maybe he's like another Osuski god. And, um, you know, he's just playing his role as of right now. Mm -hmm. Right. It could be interesting. Honestly, it, it might be a situation like that. But it, me personally, I'm still on the on a on a role where like he's a gentleman. But like I could kind of <laughs> I could kind of see a world in which like oh, he's saying a lot of stuff right now to kind of make it seem like he's not necessarily like the Otsuki God, quote unquote, man, because he understands that he's not necessarily trying to just deceive humans. Now he's also trying to deceive Momoshiki, and if Momoshiki realizes that Amado is making in discrepancies and and okay. like labeling what is divine arts and what isn't. That could possibly be one of his tactics to like fool Momoshiki. Nah, bro, bro, bro. Yeah. Hamada is a father, father ninja, bro. Father scientist who um <laughs> Shiki found and just enlisted his help, bro. Cause like based on unless it, it's just like if you're looking at his reaction to like information and new details and all that jazz, even in this chapter, right? He's like like this dude is about to cry, bro. Like literally panicking, shouting at Shikamaru. He's not in the same room, so he doesn't need to like physically be <laughs> doing all this shit, bro. So I'm like, bro, it doesn't make sense for him to be on the cover of Shibai. Uh, it, it, it's like if he's acting this way in front of in front of people, then it would make sense and you know, he could justify. It. But if he's by himself and he's just doing all this shit, and if he's reacting to information, even having like internal dialogue that suggests he doesn't know what's happening, it's just, it would be weird, you know? Like he's trying to trick himself as well. Or you could argue maybe he has like a dual personality. <laughs> maybe he doesn't even know that he's Otsutsuki. Maybe this Otsutsuki being that possesses his body does it and he doesn't realize when, he, when it happens, you know? I guess you could say that. But that's the only way I see see that theory like being possible. If he doesn't know himself, he's like two beings in one body. Maybe it's a, maybe it's a situation like Boruto, but you know, a successful possession per se. Mm. Yeah, I, I see what you mean. I, I kind of mm. err on the fact that he, he's probably not Shibai. Yeah. Is, yeah. I, I, they say oh, genius. They say geniuses. They uh eliminate problems before they even happen. So this could be a part of his his ultimate plan, though. So. You know, I, I don't 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 take Amado short, bro. Just because he was yelling and stuff and it seemed like he was panicking, that could have been a ploy to, you know, <laughs> make Shikamaru, you know, think that, you know, he doesn't have everything yeah. under control when he actually really does. Not, nah, bro. He, yeah, he does. Fun. The only thing he has under control is that Kawaki, bro. And, like, he can yeah. shut him down and that's basically it. Facts. Hey, we did get some more intel about that, how he has mm -hmm. to actually see Kawaki to actually be able to shut him down.